This is The Ridge Report, Niagara University's student-produced newscast. Get a glimpse into campus news and upcoming events, today's stories, open mic night, cupcake wars, dance marathon, and Tuesday Night Live. Welcome, I'm Leanne Stuck. And I'm Scott Riley. Students showed off their talents last Tuesday night at open mic night in Upper Level Galley. Third place was awarded to spoken word artist Zadi Taveras. Senior Matt Stevens sang his way to second place. And Kate Dickey took home first place with a rendition of Pumped Up Kicks, using a looping machine to live record her voice. The night began with a special gift from Nuska to Father Marr, an engraved end table to commemorate his inauguration. Last week, CBB sponsored Cupcake Wars, a competition to create the most creative cupcake display. The event held in the multi-purpose room Friday showcased the decorative abilities of students to frost and design a cupcake display. The students were given 15 minutes to create the most unique cupcake design. The winners received Panera and Wegmans gift cards. This past Friday, one of our own communications students hosted a dance marathon in the Kiernan Center. We caught up with Victoria Pascuzzi for more. So on Friday, March 28th, we held a 12-hour dance marathon in Kiernan starting at 6 p.m. Um, we danced all night long. Um, we uh, did, well, Alpha Sigma Alpha was there and they did Pi Sister, which turned into uh, people donate and Pi some professors and administrators. So that was a good time. Um, but yeah, 12 hours of dancing and free food and yeah. Well, spread out throughout the night. We definitely had at least over 100 people there. Um, so people, people came early and then left. People would come later on and stayed. Some people came in the middle of the night just for the food, which was fine. But uh, yeah, we had a solid turnout. We definitely hit the 2500 mark, which is really great. Uh, we're still waiting on a few more donations from people, but yeah, my goal, I was aiming for around 1000 so I'm really pleased with the fact that we doubled that plus more. And they're going to go to Cradle Beach, which is a summer camp in Angola. Uh, it's a camp for kids with disabilities and who are living under the poverty line. Uh, Cradle Beach works on a sliding fee scale, so the cost of attendance varies based on the family's income, and then whatever they can't afford, Cradle Beach covers, so all the money raised is going to go towards financial assistance for those families. I've worked there um, for a few years now. I've been there since I was 13, so I wanted to give back. Niagara hosted Tuesday Night Live, a student parody show in a packed Leary Theater. Students were laughing in their seats watching the TNL cast perform skits that were NU related. Hilarious skits poke fun at different majors, the clubbing scene, and people who are gym obsessive. There were two shows due to an overwhelming student interest, and it was not a disappointment. That's all for now. Tune in next time for more info on campus news and upcoming events. Or visit our website at www.niagara.edu. And be sure to check out our other video programs, The NU Clue, which airs every Monday night, and The Ridge Note, and use daily event updates. I'm Leanne Stuck. And I'm Scott Riley. Thank you for watching The, the Ridge, Ridge Report. Report.